Hi class, I wanted to do a follow-up video um, reworking one of the problems from the previous lecture to show you how you can very easily use your calculator to get this integral. All right, so I want to go back to the problem about the um, number of individuals who suffered from uh, side effects from taking ibuprofen for arthritis. So instead of going through the, the tough calculations that I did in the calculator, uh, your calculator can do all of it really easy for you in one step. So click on this stat button here if you have your calculator. You're going to go over to tests. Now what you want to do, there's a whole bunch of tests here, but you want to keep scrolling all the way down until you see a test called one proportion Z int, and that's supposed to be for interval. And then what you're going to do is you're going to hit enter. So under one dash proportion Z interval. All right, what it's going to ask you here is X. So that's the number of number of people who are responding to having adverse side effects. So that's 23. The N here is going to be 440, right? That's the total number of people. When I go down the level of confidence, you have to change it to 90. It will always default to 95%. And then all you have to do is you just have to hit calculate. here. And boom, look at this. P hat 0 0.052, 0 0.052. You'll notice that their intervals are off just a little bit here, and that's just due to rounding. But the lower bound, 0 0.034, 0 0.034, 0 0.069, they, they actually rounded this one to 0 0.07, and boom, you got it right there. So even if you put 0 0.035 instead of 0 0.034, that's perfectly okay. All right, the, the, the whole idea is just to be really close to the bound. But you can keep doing this. You can verify this with any of them. Like if we go back to this problem right here in in the in the in the homework or in the lecture slide, excuse me. If I hit stat, go back to tests, go down to one proportion z interval. All right. Well, here you put in the the number of x value, the number of people who had the um, who said yes. Well. Of course, they have to back out of that. B.52 times 1600. So it looked like 832 said that they had um, who support this policy. So stat, tests, one, one prop Z interval. It was 832, 1600 total people. We want a 95 and hit calculate and look at this 0 0.4955, 0 0.496, got it, 0 0.44, 0 0.544, 0 0.544, right there. So you're more than welcome to even use your calculator for this if you want instead of going through the long, hard, arduous calculations um, by hand. 